Dark row. <laughs> enrichment? Oh yeah, this is cool. Wait, not enrichment. Okay, this I'm very excited about. For the staff lounge, um, the girls all like tea a lot. Um, and this is like a tea organizer. So it's got a little drawer and then it has slots to put packets of tea so they can have a tea station. Oh, it's open upside down. I thought this was just the box, I skimmed the note. I'm not sure how or if this will work for you, but my friends in production tell me this is really the only camera currently on the market specifically designed for extended length streaming from Wi-Fi with the film industry grade heat dissipation. <laughs> I'm taking a chance that this is one of those amazing pieces of Asian technology that will help you when you need something between the overheating phone and the hard to zoom phone. Love what you do from Dr. Nick. Space? I don't know if Space is here because he's sick, but Space is gonna freak out. Dude, this is a camera. Oh. Yeah. Holy shit! This is like... Uh... It is, it's called a live stream camera. You know what, I'm gonna keep that note, actually. It's a thousand dollar camera! Dr. Nick! I'm not, I'm not putting this in the tech bulge, I'm going to put it on Space's desk. That's crazy, bro. That's crazy. Look, and it's got like it's the monitor. In the back. It has an ethernet port in the back of it? What? Why have we never heard of this? Why is nobody using this in streaming? I've never seen this camera before. Barking Bard, what if we just unlock something? It why, it never overheats, the zoom is crazy. It's super, this is so light. It's so much lighter than a DSLR. Dude. Mr. Danny G, thank you for the sub. Barking Bard, thank you. Uh, we just unlocked streaming. Everyone's gonna be so jealous. Dr. Nick, thank you so much. Oh my God. What an insane gift. Oh, you stream with just that and no backpack? Wait, you what? Can, you can do backpack, <laughs> but it does uh, ethernet and Wi-Fi will combine them. Just doesn't do cellular. Can you imagine? Space's desk. Wait, so, okay, technically, in theory, you could just walk around with just that camera and it would stream straight from the camera, is what yes. we're saying. Like, you don't need a backpack. You could literally just have the camera. Yes. That's nuts. What the fuck is this? I don't know, but I bet it's from Dark Row. It is. Enjoy your gift from Dark Row. Hide box? Uh, I assume this is for rats. Plastic hide box. Thank you. And then uh, a doormat. Is this for staff lounge or is this for enrichment? Do you know? Enrichment. Ooh. Storage. Not from Dark Row. I don't know who it's from. They didn't sign it. Whoa! It's meant for vertical too. We can do TikTok streams with it. <gasps> Whoa! Wow, wow. Look at all these ports. It really, it does just have an Ethernet port in there. Wow, how weird. And it's got all the hot, they've got hot shoes, so there's power to that, so you yeah. can power your microphone without any cables. And then you can even plug all the mics into there too. That's cool. It's pretty sick. If this thing does well with heat, that could be nuts. I don't know what this is for. Maybe enrichment. No more freezer streams in Arizona. Chat, no more popsicle ice packs for you. Shruti asked for crocheted wasp nests, so here you go. This is potentially the first of many. Let me know if you need more. Squished it flat to fit in the letter, but it should be easy to get fluffed up again. Thank you for all the great, important work you do at Alveas. I hope y'all don't... I hope y'all get dive bombed by wasps less in the future. One hive, one mind from Poncho. How sweet. <laughs> Look, it's another one. 
That is so, you guys are so nice. Evan, what do you think? Let me know an email address I can send the receipt to so that you can get the warranty registered. Um, you can do info at alveasanctuary.org. Look at Shruti! Shruti, how, did you see the other one? They sent two. <laughs> two different people sent you wasp nests. They crocheted, it's so nice. Do they help prevent wasp nesting? I think the idea is that other wasps think it's a, it's a decoy. So then other wasps are like, I can't put my nest there because there's already one there. And I'm way too respectful for that, you know? That's the vibe. Or if you don't want to anthropomorphize them, it's a territorial thing. Whoa! Whoa, it smells funky. It's uh, leaves and sphagnum moss for uh, bugs and for reptiles. And berry loops. Chins love these. Thank you, tree bulge. Ooh, this one's fun. My Alvea Sanctuary, Grasshopper Lamau. <laughs> no, that's good. That's anatomically correct, I think. This is from Emma. It's got a little hedgehog on it, cute. Dear Maya, I've been a fan ever since my partner introduced me to your Tiny Mike's video and have been subscribed for years. This probably sounds strange, but you feel like a friend. We really have enjoyed watching your channel grow over the years. We're so proud of what you've done with Alveus. I saw these really sweet bug charms on Etsy. Shop is Eat Toast and thought of you. I decided to make you a charm bracelet of them. I hope you like them. If not, you can find another use for them for the little charms. I don't have any socials, LOL. With kindness, Emma. <laughs> and then she put a sticker here and it says, you'll do great out there, kiddo. Remember, we're always rooting you on, okay? And then put an arrow and said, this is me and my partner cheering you on silently without our socials. I'm the green one, he's the brown one. <laughs> She made a charm bracelet and put a packet of tea in here. <laughs> oh my gosh, how cute. Oh, candy. <laughs> a candy. <laughs> Look how cute. It's a present. It says Maya on it. Ah! These are cute. Okay, these are like little Etsy. Here's a, okay. Here's a ring. And it's got a little, this is from an Etsy shop, I think. It has a little flower ring. This is, oh, these are earrings. They're little bird earrings. <laughs> There's a yellow one and a blue one. That's so cute. Little birds. Okay. Cute, cute, cute. And then a little bracelet. Oh, oh my God. Oh, I gotta come over the table. Oh my God. Okay, there's an Etsy shop that makes these bug charms. Okay, first of all, look at this. I don't know if this would be considered a bug. I think it's a, it's like a sea cucumber or something. Frick! Okay. Look at it. Ugh, is this camera on auto? Focus. This is an isopod. So cute. A little freaking beetle. Oh yeah, that, that's that's good. Oh, look at a little beetle. What the, what is this? I don't know, a spider? <laughs> Rubber ducky. Another beetle. Another isopod. Another beetle. And it's all in a charm bracelet. A freaking bug charm bracelet. She bought these charms and then made it into a bracelet for me. That's so freaking nice. I wish I had this at the bug conference, dang it. I would have been the talk of the town. Oh yeah. <laughs> I'm going to break it. Bug bracelet goes insanely hard. Evan's jealous. Evan, he's jealous of my bug bracelet and it's fine. You can't have it though. Thank you so much. That is so nice. I'm gonna put them safely into this bag and I'm obsessed with this and I'm going to wear it to bars. I'm gonna wear it out and everyone's gonna be like, oh my God, what are those? And then I'm gonna do my bug pitch for them. Thank you so much. That is so nice. <laughs>